Was there if... even an intro for this? Uh... There wasn't. No. Oh, this one's pretty good. <laughs> what is this? Oh my god. Since I really want to read it. words that I think will get me demonetized, but... Well, you're not monetized anyway. I'm anyways. not monetized, Patrick, so... Go for it. Go for it. He recommended the College Kings on the basis that it was relevant to Crusader Kings 3. Needless to say, I saw this as a challenge to smite as many women as possible with my vast amount of Paradox Grand Strategy knowledge and set out to demonstrate the power of a Sigma male. This goes on for quite some time. And frequently cite this game when arguing with my classmates on why Stacy secretly desires me to uh, pull it <laughs> over Chad and his epic speed out. <laughs> this man does not have sex. This oh, man yeah, I do. is struggling. This man is struggling. <laughs> Alright, you're honestly the mic I've done one. This one, I think, came from a dark place. I'm gonna be honest, this one came from a really dark place. Whoa. I hope oh, this oh guy God. is doing better. Yeah. And then I'm searching the depths of the internet for the absolute worst. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting the unfunny ones. Father Joseph's getting the... <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> Johnny Test! It's Johnny Test! Don't How much fucking Johnny test me? <laughs> I hate this video so much. <laughs> oh my god. This is fantastic. This I don't is, know what you're on. I gotta go find worse games. What are worse yeah, games? I think I found Jesus. One second. <laughs> oh. This one's. You, you gotta pay attention to it. 5,171 yeah. and a half hours on record. What, what this game, game is, this? is called. Let me find it. Um, <laughs> part of it is in Japanese, but it's called Koikatsu Party. I've played this oh. game a oh. bit, and it's okay. It's just okay. It's no, I yeah, understand nothing. that. Right, right. It's just yeah. okay. It's okay. The next review after that just says. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> this guy didn't even play for a full- he's got .3 hours on record. I think he just bought the game to make this review. And it says, <laughs> my mind said no. My wallet said no. My college said no. My dong said yes. My dong won. What is it? <laughs> your dick, not your brain. <laughs> That's how I always think. I found one. <laughs> I wish I knew what game this was from. You know, uh... Let's take a guess at what game this could be from. Oh my god, yeah, where do two. I start? My guess is League. <laughs> Wait, no, what? time out, time out. What is this? Hold on, hold on. Hey, do you want to read this out for the, for the fans? I think this is a good idea. Should... He's just silent. <laughs> Um, I think I'm gonna read this in my regular voice so uh, you okay. can really hear, feel yeah, the, the emotion. Yeah, the emotion. No, yeah, that's fine. Of course, yeah. of course. Okay. Of course. Okay. okay. Alright boys, let me set the scene for you. My weeb friend bought this game for me not too long ago as a sort of joke. Little did he know the dark path that he would set us down. And yes, I did say us because I was bringing him down with me. The first thing you'll notice when you open up the game is the character editor. Yes, as you already know, this game is about making your own waifu. The character customization is staggering from how you want her hair to whether or not she has her butthole bleached with the persona of a dark lord. <laughs> After you spend your time what? making your waifu, you move over to the performance aspect. Oh my God. First being a kawaii concert that will melt your heart with your waifu's smiles. But your wife wouldn't be smiling if you knew what was in store for her next. And the second performance being an all-you-can-want bang sesh. Like, Jesus Christ, this game pulled no punches <laughs> to getting to the action. Especially when you choose the girl-on-girl -girl action like any sane man would. For crying out loud, there was no foreplay. Just straight to the loudest scissoring you could ever imagine. 
making you run to your door and lock it, lest your family walk in and see you as the dishonorable idiot you truly are. Oh, and to let you know, when I said that my buddy was being brought down with me, I truly meant it. I gave him the heart attack to end all heart attacks when he saw our wife who's <laughs> grinding up on each other without the littlest hint of what was coming up in the slightest. But alas, while I can never gain back the level of friendship that we once had, his horrified screams made me smile and end this playthrough on a note of pure bliss. The bus did not help as well. That got me. That got me good. Oh my god, that one was good. That, that was, was a good one. Oh my god. Okay. As far as dog petting VR games go, this is a dog petting VR game that includes a dog that you can pet. I was a bit skeptical at first, given that other VR games I played did not include a dog to pet. However, my worries were for naught, as this game started with a dog that I could indeed pet. Now petting the dog is not the only thing you can do in this game. You can also throw various items that the dog will then fetch and bring back to you. If you decide that this particular pup's fetching prowess is worthy of a pet, then oh boy, let me tell you, you can pet the dog. Now, what the dev does not tell you about this game is that it takes place in a world where gravitational anomalies can occur. When I was exhausted of petting the dog, I threw the stick. The dog then proceeded to fetch the stick and bring it back, so I went ahead and took the stick from the dog in preparation to throw the stick again. However, I grabbed the stick with my left hand. I am not left-handed. This posed a minor inconvenience. I went to transfer the stick to my right hand, and the stick became st <laughs> The stick became stuck in my body. In surprise, I let go of the stick, and the dog went to fetch the stick that was <laughs> I need to hold on. <laughs> and the dog went to fetch the stick that was now stuck inside of my body. What happened next still haunts me. As the dog <laughs> Okay, hold on. I need to take a break. <laughs> <coughs> My body expelled the stick at incredible speeds. Like, how do you push bullets out of your body in most first person shooters to regain health? This propelled the dog at an angle straight into the air. I could only stare on in horror as my perfectly pet worthy <laughs> pooch spiraled out of control. <laughs> <laughs> you guys aren't finding this as funny as I am, but I got six hours of sleep last night. <laughs> I, I can't go My on. God. What the fuck? Still in shock, I quickly grabbed another throwable object. This frees me to see if I could summon the dog back to Earth. However, this had unforeseen consequences, which may have set into motion events that I cannot fathom. As I threw the disc shaped potential canine savior, the dog, the dog fell from the heavens. <laughs> I watched as my wayward pup. I can't go on. This man's losing his mind. I wish I, you guys could see my face. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Hopefully, a developer can specify. In conclusion, this game does exactly what it says it would. <laughs> Is it worth $5? It really depends on how much you want to pet a dog in VR. <laughs> can I ever forget the horrific event that unfolded before my eyes? Probably not. All right, this one that I have to take found. a break. I have to take a break. Okay. Hold on. Yeah, let's <sighs> relax for a oh second. My God. Like, oh I my just God. need to comprehend what the fuck I just heard. Okay. I wasn't even able to catch most of it because he kept laughing. <laughs> <laughs> I had no idea what he was saying. <laughs> Action. My first maiden from out of a primordial soup, tentatively my weenie awakened from its slumber, then fully roused it basked in the glory of things better left undisclosed. My acquiescent paragon of lust. 
Fear not, dear reader, for such concepts as dignity and pride have long been. Such questions are irrelevant. Are we not primal beasts driven by ravenous instinct? At least mine lurks where only doe-eyed digital beauties of a legal age reside. Web-toed slubber gullions, I say, my slapper fellow. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I'm so confused. What was this game for? Oh, this is the same one as last time. It's the build your own waifu. <laughs> There's just another one that says, got rejected by my own waifu when I asked her out. <laughs> There's oh another guy God. that got the game for free, played it for an hour, and his wife left. <laughs> Oh my god, this is... this is the worst. <laughs> you wanna know what else is the worst? Not subscribing. This video took me like a month to make, so if you could subscribe because you genuinely enjoy it, or like just go tell someone else to subscribe, that would mean a lot. Thank you. I don't know why I said this so angrily, sorry. What's it called? You know, this will be the finale, this is the finale. We all, we all get a review from this one game. I okay. love you, Colonel Sanders, a finger looking good dating simulator. <gasps> okay, are we all finding a review from this? I'm, I'm looking, I'm looking, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I've got to find, like, a... Like, a story. Oh, you have to find a story? Yeah. So I can, like, I, I, I need to add theater to it, you know? Zero out of ten. I didn't get a d from the Lord of Chicken even once. I wanted to feel his <laughs> fill my insides with his <laughs> But instead, he just danced with me. I want my money back. I can see how this you know. This is a free I game. I can see how you would- <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> I can see- I can see why this guy isn't satisfied with his product. Yeah, It just know, makes right? sense. Like, alright, alright, now, the story. The story. Oh my god, this okay, is- Okay, okay, I'm ready. <laughs> I'm gonna have to interpret some of this. Um, <laughs> Remember that bit I did where I had all the text floating by as Kendrick read out a very long and awful response? There's no editing. I'm gonna do it again. Never have I ever been harder than I am now. Like, god fucking damn it, I am the hardest fucking motherfucker on this fucking planet. Like Colonel fucking Sanders. Please give me your sweet crispy chicken nuts so I can finally come. Colonel Sanders is the hottest being in the universe. Fuck thick Ashley and the JoJo fucker. I only want Colonel Sanders' big fat juicy chicken uh, flavored crispy down. nutsack to be inside. <laughs> Wait, big fat juicy chicken flavored crispy nutsack trademark. <laughs> <laughs> to, be, to be inside That's the of charm. my mouth. Filling it with the most wonderful flavors that only the god himself can achieve. If you ever thought that you wanted anything else on this planet, or even the universe, think again. Fucker, I don't know. <laughs> I'ma tell you that- Oh, think again, bitch. I'ma tell you what you should want. Colonel Sanders, dick ball- Dick- Dicky <laughs> ball- what? Wait, what? Wait, wait, what? Dicky ball? ball? Trademark? Dicky ball. Yeah. Dicky Dick ball. ball? <laughs> Dick of all trademark. To me, this wasn't a mere game. No, it was a dream come true. I don't think I ever came harder, and I don't think you will either. If you don't love Colonel Sanders' big, tender, oh, flavorful, crispy, yummy, juicy, cream-filled, perfect nutsack, and his large and in-charge, plentiful, sweet, tasty seed, then you don't deserve the gift of life. I would say that the only reason I was born was to play this game. The only way I could come harder is if Colonel Sanders saved me from that stupid McDonald clown. <laughs> that is all. P.S. This game is good, I guess. One final note. I wish Colonel Sanders would have come to my house and used his Rectum Ripper 3000 trademark, his large penetration device, on my tight widow bunghole. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, can we get a round of applause? Just simply that was beautiful. Incredible. That was incredible. And right. now, you're gonna tear to my eye. <gasps> oh, I found. what is this? Oh boy. <clears throat> oh no. One sec, I need to turn off, off uh, mic monitoring for this one. Okay, okay. Oh no. <laughs> I need to hear every little, every little smacking of my lips. Okay, oh, fade, no. fade to black, oh, fade no. to black, fade to black. 
With stage 5 terminal cancer, the doctors told me it wouldn't be cured. I saw this game come up on my recommended list. I thought to myself, with only hours left to live, I might as well spend my time doing something I enjoy. Starting the game, I was filled with immediate joy. The characters were absolutely lovable. The storyline has the depth that can only be rivaled by very few AAA titles out there. Every click left me guessing what's going to happen next, and will I get to try another one of the Colonel's chicken wings of pure ecstasy? Before I knew it, I was in the kitchen, cooking with the Colonel, helping him create Nan's potatoes and gravy. It was absolute bliss. And then it eventually happened. The game was over. Now, I'm not going to ruin the ending for anyone here, but oh my actual Colonel, it was the greatest ending you've ever seen in a video game. I sat there at my PC for hours. How had I lived my life without this game? What had I been doing with my life up until this point in time? And then it struck me. I'd been sitting there for hours. The cancer should have killed me already. Dazed and confused, I rushed out of the door to the hospital. Had the doctor gotten the diagnosis wrong? I just didn't know. I finally reached the hospital where they performed a set of tests on me. After several scans, the doctors told me that my cancer had been miraculously cured. I couldn't believe it. What had happened to me? Where did the cancer go? I had no idea. I could only put it down to one thing. This game. Next thing I know, I'm in a KFC, buying a bucket of the Colonel's delicious fried chicken. What a novel idea. Happy to be alive. 10 out of 10 would play again. That was, I forgot to be funny and comedic there. Oh my God, I was so engrossed in that story. <laughs> <laughs> I was just sitting on the edge of my seat Literally, waiting for yeah. something. I purposely made it so I didn't read ahead. And it was so worth it. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, oh, what amazing. <laughs> I put really? too much effort into reading about <laughs> Colonel Sanders. Actually, you know what? Colonel Sanders is worth it. No, Colonel Sanders is worth it. That was worth this it. This game was worth it, and I definitely suggest a play. I think you're hilarious, Joe. Thank you. I also think you're hilarious. Thank you. Thanks for watching! And thank you for staying to the end of the video. If you did watch the end, that probably means that you liked it, so you should like video this video like I said before took me like it was literally recorded a month ago that's how long it took me to edit this thing um but yeah I have I have some pretty good ideas for content coming soon so uh stick around for that like subscribe comment uh subscribe again like dislike it and then undislike it and then like it again I'll just see you next time